Now we need to seal off our vents. We seal off the vents so that we can maximize our vacuum pressure. We find the easiest way to do this is by using small garbage bags you can buy at any store. Simply take out the vent cover and place it in the bag and then put it back in the vent. Repeat this for all the vents in the house. Once the vents are sealed off, we can start cleaning them. Start from the furthermost vent from the furnace, working your way back to the furnace. Common sense, right? There are a number of different agitation tools you can use to clean the vents. Check out our video on agitation tools, which will give you an in-depth look at all these tools to help you decide which is best for you. It's important to understand that you'll need a minimum of 175 psi of air pressure to do a thorough cleaning job. For this job we are using the Cobreview camera system. The Cobreview forward skipper camera is an excellent tool to clean the vents. It has a forward skipper ball on the end and a camera right behind it. The forward skipper camera is an excellent tool as it allows us to see as we're cleaning. This way we can be sure that we haven't missed anything in the ductwork. To learn more about the Cobreview camera system, click here. The idea of the forward skip line is that we want to move all the debris out of the vent runs and into the main trunk line. Just remember to reseal the vents after you've cleaned them. Repeat this process at all the supply vents in the house. We'll clean the return air vents once the supply lines are clean.